We're with head football coach Jay Anderson to preview week one for his Yeoman squad. But before we do that, first, I want you to uh, take us back through training camp, coach. Uh, it's been a couple long weeks, but uh, some good productive work's been done by you and uh, the group of guys uh, underneath you as well. It's been a great camp. You know, I think that when you look at sort of where we started at um, on this on this road back in the spring to where we're at right now, um, I think the camp was awesome. We got through uh, the two week of camps without any major injuries. Um, and uh, we're, we're headed into week one, uh, relatively healthy. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, you got a, a lot of young guys on this team, uh, 23 first year players, but a good mix of upperclassmen as well. Uh, let's start things off with uh, your junior quarterback, uh, Lucas Pajali, a guy looking to, to kind of have a, a breakout year for you and, and lead the football team to where it wants to go. And Lucas done a great job. I think that it all really started with us bringing in Bob Saunders, our offensive coordinator, who's done a great job with all of our quarterbacks on our roster. Um, but for us, it was about bringing in a guy that can, can put a system around, you know, our play, our playmakers to put those guys in position to make plays on Saturday. Uh, we're personnel driven here, um, and uh, you know, Bob's done a great job of putting in, you know, a scheme that's going to allow for Lucas and you know a lot of our offensive weapons like Blake Buchanan and Justin Williams to really, really take off this year. Yeah, absolutely, and a lot of experience coming back on that offensive line as well, which will certainly help things out. So let's switch things over on the on the defensive side, an area you're obviously very familiar with. Um, you know, just talk about who, who we're going to rely on to be the, the leaders this year for for that unit. You know, I think that, you know, it's definitely it's C.J. Ely, who's, you know, obviously he's a preseason All-American. He played extremely well for us last year. Um, um, Spencer Connolly's had a great camp, um, and I think that he's going to really add to our defensive line and complement C.J., um, we're really excited about having Max uh, Shank back this year, and you know, and he's had a great, great camp up until this point, and um, he's, he's really primed to have a to, to have a fantastic year for us in production. Um, and you know, Adrian Kelly, our free safety, has done a great job. He's, he's moved over from strong safety to free safety this year, and he's the quarterback of our defense. He makes every coverage check for us, and he's done a great job of stepping in and in, uh, in Zach Kisley's place this year. And then Gabe Edwards, you know, he's a he's a junior. He had a great sophomore campaign. Um, and he's, a, you know, he's a captain of our of our defense, and uh, he's done a great job as well. Yeah, and let's focus a little bit now on, on this Brockport team. Uh, it's going to be a long road trip, obviously, f for the group. Uh, overnight trip to start off the season. A team that we're obviously not very familiar with, haven't played them since 1988. So what have we seen on film about, about this Brockport team so far? It's a good football program. It's, it's a program on the rise. Um, you know, I think they've had you know, two really good successful seasons where they've won more games than they're, than they're losing, um, which is – you know, it's a, it's a positive sign for those guys that they're turning the corner. Um, they do a really good job of running the football, and uh, they have an array of running backs that um, that they want to put the ball in those guys' hands and let those guys be playmakers for them. And you know, we have to do a great job on on Saturday defensively of just getting off blocks, you know, running to the football and making tackles. So, what are some other keys uh, on on the offensive end that that you hope to achieve to pull out a victory here on Saturday, Coach? Well, you know, one of the things that we want to do is we want to have a fun offense, and uh, we want it to be exciting. When you come to a game, um, you know, we want that, that game day environment to be exciting. We want to put points on the, on, on the board. Um, so the first thing always is being able to establish the run, um, you know, not make boneheaded uh, penalties and mistakes offensively, take care of the football, and then always, most importantly, is putting the ball in the end zone. Thanks, Coach. Good luck to you. Thank you.